when I say this is exactly what your customers are going to see, we're actually going to make it even better. So over the next couple of days, more features will be getting adapted, uh, more graphics will be added, and just tidying it up a little bit more, just to add that extra value, just to go, you know, that extra 5% more. Now, the actual dashboard itself is self-explanatory. On your left-hand side, we've got loads of different features, and I am going to go through those now. So the product itself, we are hosting the funnels. So when I say we are hosting it, there's three options that they have your customer. We host the funnel, we give them the, the URL, we create that URL, and they drive traffic for it from wherever they may see fit. Okay, what else they can do? Well, they can use the word press funnel plugin so they can actually have it sitting on their own WordPress site so no interaction with those whatsoever that's another option that they have also from the Facebook settings from within the software they can actually connect to their Facebook and they can basically host these funnels on their Facebook tabs within Facebook and we all know how how good that is with regards to keeping chick clicks down Facebook likes to keep everything in house so that is another option available to them we also have retargeting within the software and that's something else that we're going to show so let's start with the basics of actually creating the funnels so we would come to the left hand side we would add a new funnel or we can look at the funnels that we have already created we will go and use one that I've already created just for time purposes. Um, let's look at all funnels. So yes, yeah, so we'll just choose the top one here that we've already created. Uh, and I've kept it very simple, very basic. So we would start with the title. They would come down um, to the screen what they're gonna see directly with the text. Okay, we have four options here. We have four campaign objectives. Now the first one is an auto redirect so basically on that first page that initial question they were redirected to wherever you want them to regarding the questions that they have just answered we also have the ability to be able to add a thank you page so the thank you page is what they go to directly after they've answered the questions again just another little step what we're always trying to work on here is those micro commitments you know getting them to answer getting them into frame of mind getting them so we can segment them and basically put the right offers in front of them that we will know will convert with the answers that they are giving us okay the other option that we have also we have the ability to be able to share so share these polls to twitter share these polls um, to facebook again getting that organic traffic if they see something that they like and they share it that is advertising our polls advertising what we want to offer and obviously, we can integrate our autoresponder. Uh, and I'll look at these features in, in detail in a little while. So the questions, very, very simple. Everything has been created to keep it super simple. Okay, the navigation, basically user experience is all about simple. Anybody can use and create these actual funnels. So we've kept it simple with regard to two questions. Uh, and I've just put in here, you know, what do you like best? Dog, um, you know, click to support the redirect URL, redirect button. What else can I do? I can add a countdown timer. But again, these are all features that, you know, I can go into at a later date. I just want to show you the real basics so you understand them. So let's publish one of these tabs. So we've updated it, and now I want to go and view the funnel. So like I say, it took me less than two minutes just to put in the very basics. So I view the funnel, okay? And again, everything that you can see on the screen I have inputted. So a poll to see the most passionate pet owners. What do you like best, dog or cat? I'll go with dog because I do like dog best. Submit it. Okay, so it shows me the poll of results. Again, I can work on a poll basis. I don't have to have this option, but then what do I do? Please click below to show your support. I know that they like dogs. Again, I know it's very simple. I know they like dogs, so I'm not gonna put in front of them a cat product. Okay, so I click here and I take them to a dog trust site or whatever it may be, whether it be a CPA offer, you get the picture, you understand where we're going. Just go back to the software, okay. Okay, so if we're within the software, just have a look at the features here. So like I said, we can basically do it so it goes to a thank you page. So it will change slightly down at the bottom here um, with regards to what they see, okay. They will have a share option. Again, it will change that directly. Uh, and obviously the email. So as we go down here, 
they can integrate their autoresponder. And these are the autoresponders that we have integrated, but we aren't limited to them. We have the funneler, uh, and that basically keeps email addresses local. So it's for all those people that don't even have an email autoresponder or for people that don't have one in our list. Okay, so we will collect those. Once they manage to get one, we will upload it or they will upload it to their actual autoresponder. Okay, so as you can get loads of different disclaimers, contest rules that you can add, um, but like I say, it's a very quick demonstration of the actual product. So the stats themselves, well, if you look at the stats, okay, basically we can look at our contest, the contest that we have just set up, and we can go into those stats and really have a look at the people clicking. Uh, like I say, I'll just open it up. Okay, so it's showing the actual data entries, the conversion, the conversion rate, as we're going down, the redirects, the shares, the opt-ins, the conversion rate, really powerful stuff in here, really good stuff that we can look at and see where we're getting that interaction, see where we're getting those shares, see where we're getting those redirects, uh, and really adapt our funnels to meet the criteria of our stats and make them so, you know, the biggest thing, we're getting that massive ROI. So the Facebook setup itself, we can turn it directly to Facebook tab. So exactly the same, the funnel that you have just seen with regards, uh, you know, that's, that's hosted by us, uh, it will go directly to the tabs of the fan pages. Okay, now there's loads of different features in here and I'll quite happily show you them, um, you know, in more detail. If you want access to the actual product, hit me up and we'll give you access to it. But in a nutshell, that is it. Extremely powerful because we're doing those micro commitments, extremely powerful because we can segment those actual leads and show them different products with regards to the answers that they have just given. And also we're collecting emails, we're collecting, we're building our list, or your buyers, your customers, we're building those lists. Input all that into one, into one software. Plus, I actually mentioned, I forgot to mention the actual re, um, retargeting that we're doing here. So let's just go back over to the actual site. Um, let's just edit it so you can see that. Okay, so from within the software itself, we can do a retargeting. So we can add the retargeting pixel to here. Okay, again, extremely powerful tools. We know how powerful re retargeting is via Facebook, uh, and we can do it directly from within the software. So, like I said, in a nutshell, that's the product itself. But feel free to reach out to me, answer more questions for you, and I will happily do it. Okay, speak to you soon, guys, and I'm hoping you jump on board because it is going to be an extremely, extremely profitable launch. Thanks, guys.